and hello and welcome to the very first Glaswegian Geeks YouTube. I'm James? so thrilled. I know you get to, to see our sexy faces now. I'm not usually this hairy. I'm just doing it he's cause not, I can. He's not sexy. Fuck James. Mm. Anyway. Today we're talking about games because we yes, love games. Yes, gaming. Yes. Something a little bit different, you know. This is our uh, first one, so we might as well go for our uh, April's first. Yes. April first, uh, kind of. Our first, cool. our first game is a bit of a joke, actually. Yes. It's, it's a proper April Fool's joke. We were blessed with an eight-bit bayonetta review. Well, oh, a bayonetta game. An eight-bit bayonetta game. Yes. And you're being blessed with an eight-bit bayonetta yes. review. Yes. And um, what can you say? It's it's pretty basic. <laughs> it's it's what it says. It's Bayonetta. It's 8-bit. <laughs> <laughs> Bayonetta, the 8-bit edition. Eight, uh, well, maybe that's what they were going for. A maybe, subtle pun, mate. Maybe, maybe a, a subtle pun, aye. So, yeah, uh, anybody who knows anything about Bayonetta knows that Bayonetta is one of the you know high-flying, genre-defying um, hack-and-slash games. Um, I love it. I love it so much. I love it too much. Yes, yeah, so you have went on quite extensively before in the past. Oh, she just she she's she's queen of the gays, and the gays <laughs> don't appreciate. It. So that is that. Um, so but this eight bit this game, game, James, this game's very special, isn't it? It's um, no. <laughs> I like it, but <laughs> you could literally just put it on a mobile. It's like Flappy Bird, but nothing moves. Yeah. All you get to do is jump and shoot, which is, you know, not being it. <laughs> but, <laughs> you know, I can I can live with that. I thought, when you told me about it, I thought, oh my god, this is going to be amazing. It's going to be like a side scroll and everything. I'm so loving for this. I'm loving for it. And then it turned Mate, out I'm all about the anticlimax. <laughs> it was a big anticlimax. <laughs> It's not even that in the description. They're like, oh, yeah, you know, they, you know, she's climaxing onto your screen. They're like, oh, I bet she is. And then I just seen it and I was just like, oh, dear. Like, but I, I, it was enjoyable for like five minutes. <laughs> yeah, it was. It, it's a good little game. I don't think I've actually got a score above 2,800 points. And let's be honest, you see 2,800, you're like, oh, that's cool. That's probably a high score. No, it's like 100, hit, 100 points per enemy. <laughs> if that. So you probably no, not even that. It's no, like two hundred or something. I was like, oh shit, he, he, he's shit. shit, he's shit, shit. Um, but yeah, um, it's not the best game. No, it's really not. But uh, what you would you expect from a free game? It's free, available to download on Steam. On so, April Fools' Day. Yeah, it's so on <laughs> April Fools', which you know, good plot twist. Not the, the not the Bayonetta three that I wanted. Hasn't there, hasn't there been news announced of that, though, this uh, week? Who knows? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Let's see if it's a Nintendo Switch exclusive. I'm going to literally kill someone. Like, because Bayonetta 2 was an exclusive. I will not have Bayonetta 3 be the same. <laughs> <laughs> it will not suffer the same fate. Just no. But... Yeah, you, graphically... It's an 8-bit it's game. It's an 8-bit game. You get what you, you get what it says. It's an 8-bit game. <laughs> what do you want you know, from it? 8-bit is... Perfectly, but you know, compare. Let's compare it to old, older eight-bit games. You know, it's fucking good. Yeah, but nothing moves. Yeah, if it was you're just standing still in the one spot, if jumping. It was, if it was bad, there would be a problem. <laughs> like, uh, story-wise, James. <laughs> story-wise, it's got an amazing plot, better than Bayonetta yeah, two. Just, because just hit that on. enter button. That's your shoot. Just hit that repeatedly. I've never, I've honestly never hit an enter button or an escape button that fast in all my life. Um, it's a close second to <laughs> escape. <laughs> um, yeah, so you, yeah. Oh, uh, pensions. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do I say? What do I say? Where do I go with this? Uh, this story changed my life. Um, <laughs> It was it was it was genre defying. It was it was true. It was groundbreaking. <laughs> it made me want to become a video game designer instead of a filmmaker, and that that just that's that that spoke to me on so many <laughs> levels. I think that Bayonetta uh, the eight the eight bit edition is just you know one for generations. I'll share it with my kids. I'll share it with everyone. You know when my nephew when he's old enough to understand it, he'll be playing it. Um, and he'll understand how amazing it is. Yeah. It's fantastic. Um, so a, a genuine eight, uh, a genuine score for eight bit bayonetta. Genuine. 
Like, compare it... That's the thing. Compare it to other 8-bit games. So, you're going back in time. A 3? <laughs> I would say a definite 2. Like, if, if you could move if there was a story, then, yeah. It'd probably get we'd higher. We'd probably take this a bit more seriously, but no one's taking this game seriously. No. <laughs> Uh, but I found myself playing it for like about 45 minutes before I thought I have wasted my life. <laughs> like, I am going to hell and my only sin will be you fucked up. <laughs> like, you wa- you played Bayonetta. The 8-bit Bayonetta actually came from Lucifer himself because <laughs> when you told me about it, I was like, oh, this is going to be amazing. An 8-bit, I bet you it's an eight, a full 8-bit version of the first game and I'm just going to be living for it. No, 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 no. I'm just shooting things and jumping and even then I can't fucking judge the jumps. So, no, you know what? I, I, I don't like it. That upset me. Bad April Fool's joke. <laughs> like It was a good April Fool's joke for you because I know you'd go mental over it. Uh, I mean, if you compare it to like the actual game, there's no comparison. No, it's a zero. It's game, a zero. The actual Bayonetta one is just fantastic. There's no argument there and I will not hear an argument about it. Um, Bayonetta 2, the only flaw that had was being an exclusive. Uh, may they learn from their, 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 may they learn their lessons. Uh, yeah lest no one buy the third game. <laughs> but yes, um, Bayonetta is my queen. The 8-bit version did not excite me. It did not lead me to climax, nor was it supposed to. But um, it was just tickling it was a, the it buzz. Was, it was a, <laughs> yeah, that's what it was doing. It was just a, a wee tease, which is what Bayonetta can be, I suppose. Yes. Oh, why and did they do that? to fuck people over. Well, that's the end. Yes. <laughs> I'm not talking about this anymore. Bye. <laughs> Geek out, guys. I'm yeah. off. Geek out.